I'm off to see my mummy, the wonderful mummy that is. She is, she is a wizard of whiz, if ever a miss there is. The wonderful mother of is, she was a devil, but I'm naffed it up, but who cares, I don't know. Because of the wonderful things she does. She, I'm off to see the mummy, my wonderful mummy that is. And look at my eyes, oh gosh, for some reason I've, I've, Got a swell in there, or a bit there, and a swelling up there. But not to worry, I can ponder on, I can do it. Yes, I've sorted the ducks this morning and the gooses, and they're very, 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 very happy. Yes, they are indeed. Oh, I've, I've tried a, a, new, a new hairstyle. What do you think? Yes, I have indeed. I was having terrible trouble with me hair this morning. It's quite long, you see. It goes down to my, uh, longer than my waist. And um, I'm, I've been having a devil, a devil of a job, you see. Once it's washed and straightened, it's really hard to put up. Yes, it is, because it's very slippery. It's very sleek. I know it doesn't look sleek. It looks a mess. But if I don't put it up, and because I haven't cut it and I don't know how long, because if I don't put it up, it blows all over the place. It goes in front of my eyes. And then what do I do? I fall over, of course. You know, I mean, you've seen me often enough falling over. So uh, falling over is not in my good books. Not at the minute. Not when my knees are such a catastrophe. Yes, with, with all the um, running around and whatnot in and to and fro in. And thing me bobs and me doodahs. Yes. So... I need, I need to fix my knees. I'm sure they will get better sooner rather than later because I need to carry on building. Carry on building. Let's go carry on building. Yes, I have to finish my veg cage. I'm having thunking thinks about the, uh, the duck house that I want to build and I'm having a really, really, really good idea. But hey ho, you know me and ideas. Yes, you shouldn't think they say. It's dangerous when you think about things. It really too is. It, it really is, especially when your name's Angela and you're me. Because thinking about things and pondering about ponders is 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 just is is just sort of ridiculous for me because I don't just think on them. I dwell on them, and I don't stop dwelling until I've, I've a... Oh, there's a hawk. I don't... Oh, it's a red kite. Yes, I'm glad the old birds are inside. No, so when I start pondering, I don't stop pondering until my pondering is all done. And then when my pondering is all done and I've completed my work that I've been pondering about, then I'm satisfied. It doesn't matter what it is. No, truly, it doesn't. You see, some years ago, I was pondering were all my life about pondering about playing the piano and I pondered and I pondered and then 30 years ago I bought myself a piano a second hand piano not a new one but a second hand one poor piano delivery man he had such a job getting it up the stairs to my place well not this one but my other place so there it was up in the dining room he had to go up a flight of two steps a two flights of steps anyway it was in the dining room and I thought now what am I going to do you see it comes a time if you've got a ginormous piano in your dining room and it was ginormous so um and the dining room was small and um yes so I thought what am I going to do the only thing I can do is learn to play it so I did in a spate of two years, I was playing grade eight classical. Yes, I taught myself to play it. I did have a few lessons from a nice man down the road in um, in Newport there. So he, I had a few lessons off him. He taught me the proper way to play because I fell in love with the piano when I was a young girl in school. And we had the most marvelous music teacher, Mrs. Brown. And she could play piano like nobody's business. And I used to just love uh, being in her class and listening to her play. And so I, I was in the choir as well. Yes, believe it or not. Yes, yeah, so first soprano 
in the choir. Yes. In any case, I fell in love with the piano with Mrs. Brown's uh, teachings. And, or Miss Brown, I should say, I do apologize. And so then I bought my piano. And now, because I've been so busy, but everything I try to do, whether it's painting, whether it's building, whether it's learning something new, stitching, um, I don't stop until I've completed my task of learning and I can, I can do it. So there we are. I, I don't know why I'm this way, but I just am. I've got to have something to chew on. Oh, there's that kite again. If I don't have something to chew on, and I don't mean food or the odd pie. I know I'm poorly sized, but I don't eat many pies. I don't mind telling you. Yes, you see, I'm active. I'm active in the day with the uh, with the flockers and the gardening. And I'm more active in the, in the spring and summer and autumn months than I am in the winter. Yes, but I, 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 I'm waffling on again. Anyway, I gotta go. Uh, yes, I better quack on with my uh, daughterly duties today and go and see my mumsy. And yep, so I'll catch you all later. I, I haven't even switched the computer on for a few weeks. So I'm just uploading as I film stuff on my on my phones and yes this is my new phone and i've smashed it to smithereens yes so i can only use this one indoors when it's not liable to get wet yes in any case i'm going to sling my hook i'm going to off my jolly well and i'm going to go and pick my mumsy up because mumsy and i and my sister we're going on an outing not very far it's a necessity outing so we've got to do it so I shall see you guys later. Stay safe. Love and hugs from me and the ducks and the chickens and the gooses and the garden and the plants. And yes, did I say from me and mumsy and sistery? And yes, so I shall see you all again later. Stay safe. Take care. Stay warm. And uh, yeah, God bless you all. TTFN. Ta-ta for now. Bye.